All right, we are live. Hello and welcome back to Resident Evil 5. Been a while. Hope it turns out all right. I last ended at exactly 11 p- er, 11 p.m. Nice. Let's go. Organize, um... Not yet, I promise I will. What can I buy? Oh, so basically it's the weapons I just got. I am recording. Yes, let me, uh... Yeah, I'm... If not, it'll be slightly worse quality, but I'm pretty sure I hit it. Yep. Alright, so I can basically just buy what I... Just found. I'll buy a bit of first aid spray. For the 24th. Uh, I'd have to check. There's a shit ton, of, shit ton of machine gun ammo. Upgrade. Piercing. That might be the case, actually. Well, I guess for now we're gonna have to just, uh... Deal with that. Ouch. Hello again, Pretender. Hope you enjoyed the uh, last stream and the raid, and hope you'll enjoy this. I know this is probably just some store, like some crap in storage, but I can't help but see that and think of uh, the tarp covering my dad's uh, grill back at home. Like, it looks like the exact same size, like the curves are just right on it. I think those are bodies, guys. What the hell happened here? I'm up and be king of the hill. <laughs> exactly. Yep. Oh, great! Another boss fight. Excella. What's going on? Gonna kill Excella, Ella, Ella, eh, eh. Oh, Wesker is an asshole? You don't say so. Don't worry. Your mission is at its end. Ouroboros is on the eve of its appearance. Six billion cries of agony will burn a new balance. Sorry, Wesker, but not on my watch. Albert, you said we'd change this world together. Oh, why? I thought they were partners. Wesker doesn't give a damn about anybody but himself. <laughs> Soon, even you will understand, Chris. One glimpse of my new world, and it will all make perfect sense. Show yourself! 
Unfortunately, it's too late for you. You will not live to see the dawn. Sorry, Excel, but it appears Uroboros has rejected you. Though you have been an excellent asset, I have one last task for you. Tentacles again. Oh, great! That's what the corpses are for. It's one of these kind of boss fights. It's Grave Lord Nito again. Maybe. These bosses are getting less and less inspired in this game. Like, they're all just big tentacle monsters of some sort. Like, come on. Still not doing anything yet, so it's all cutscene. Oh, good. Chivalry does good stuff for me in cutscenes, I guess. Persistent son of a bitch. Really, it's more of a daughter of a bitch. Do you think our weapons can hurt that thing? I don't know. We gotta get the hell out of here before it destroys this place. Yeah, that might be advisable. And here I thought that would be a boss. Oh, we're doing this kind of nonsense again. Come on! Roger! Take it! Okay. It's tearing! We can't stay here! I guess I can't do anything about it being right there. And, ooh, some treasure. Talk to me, I am Grill. See, in 4, you would have had to at least actually properly dodge all that shit. And this is kind of like, I don't know, like lame? Oh, look, this monster is just an obstacle to you walk around. Like, really? You can do more than that, game? Before I go, oh, uh, lockers. Let me do these. Oh, look, nothing. Oh, look, nothing. That probably just fly out a little bit right there. I think it did. Oh, great. They're getting backed up. Oh, God. Don't get backed up. Oh god damn it, please resuscitate me. Don't be reckless. Yes, try not to be reckless here. Ah! 
Great job, Shiva. Oh, hey, we killed it. Just knife it. Oh no, nope, don't get close enough to knife it. Bad idea, bad idea, bad idea. Chris? Oh god, what get oh my god, get this off me. Going back to RE0 days. Which honestly I will say one thing, and this is This game is better than RE0, no doubt about it. RE0 did the two protagonist thing better. It just did. You're dead dead now, right guys? Right? Okay. Ooh, isn't this cool? Read the document. Report on Project W. Project taking a W for the win. 1998. Ooh, this is a... Uh... Look how late this is. I was born before that. It's been confirmed that the research acting with the raccoon sea Arclay research to was due to the involvement of Project W test subject number 13. Very good luck. Therefore referred to as Albert. His death in the accident is maintaining any further information and impossibly. Albert's death was confirmed by the information department. Probably not very well. But oh, come on. That was totally a good joke. Albert's death put the current success rate of Project W down to 18%. The quote of qualified individuals for the project has been drastically reduced and must be addressed immediately. This poses a grave situation for any progress that can hope to be made in the project. Since there is no roster of qualified individuals to replace the uh, recent losses, it would be advisable to start selecting individuals from the pool of failed candidates. After this, adjustments can be made that will... I up 93% of the quota prior to Albert's death. Umbrella Information Department, Alex W. For the W. <clears throat> Ooh, a book. Spencer's Notebook. Nice. I received word that Raccoon's, Raccoon City has been wiped out. The Americans finally took action against us. Hope the irony of us using the very military machine that was supposed to protect them from foreign attackers to kill their own people is not lost on them. Oh, great. We're getting preachy now. Uh... While the danger posed by a threat of the T-Virus spring was very real, I don't think Americans will easily forgive their government for the deaths of 100,000 peop 100, of their own people. If the truth of this matter is ever brought to light, support for the current administration will plummet. I don't think he wants that. This would have been Clinton at the time. <laughs> I'm not trying to bring real politics in, but just, like, they do have like, I guess, any real president existing while well, this is kind of hilarious. Even a child can see that they will come after Umbrella with everything they have. To hide their own foolish mistakes, they'll blame Umbrella for Raccoon City's annihilation. I mean, it is kind of Umbrella's fault, you guys, I mean... You guys did just make bioweapons you couldn't control. But seeing Umbrella will share Raccoon City's fate, perhaps it will be to a lesser degree. Umbrella was nothing but a tool for the research of the progenitor virus. Even without that tool, the research still survives. Only Umbrella's lowly employees will be hurt by the dissolution. Secret research involving the progenitor virus is protected. Then can always rebuild an... B rebuild anew. So, all right. Raven, I've already made preparations for such a plan. The research facility in Africa remains a secret. And it is therefore the progenitor virus. And it is there that the progenitor virus will be produced. Something that we didn't achieve until the late 1980s. Only a handful of people in the company are even aware of the African facility's existence thanks to our strict regulation of the flow of information. Eh, that is good on their part, you know. Need to know basis and all that. Only a minimum amount of personnel were ever transferred from Africa to other locations, and they were always closely monitored. Director Bailey has been confined to the African facility for almost 30 years, and even that has all been for it this day. All that remains is to close facility and everything will go according to my plan. Once the facility is gone, all of its connections to the umbrella will disappear with it. They won't have to deal with anyone who has a level 10 security clearance, as they're the only ones who know of this African facility's existence. 
Everyone else will be summarily disposed of. Okay, Spencer. Good job, Spencer. It didn't work out for you too well. It did it. I see you be protected. One, one bear is a treasure. One should not leave behind a map. A printout is stuck inside the notebook. Personnel with access to company secrets. Oswald S. Deceased. Hunting F. Imprisoned. Saki T. Deceased. Jenny K. Whereabouts unknown. Carlos M. Found. Elimination obtained. Eliminated. Carlos. Okay. Uh, Brandon B. Deceased. 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 What about Mark? Shouldn't he have been in there? Use the key card. Open sesame. No, I did it. Wee. I wonder if we're gonna face a boss soon. Like maybe as soon as we go up that uh, staircase, just maybe. Maybe they're gonna be the boss that kills me. Come on, Roger. You grab it, Roger. Shava, get your dumb ass out of the way. Let's see, um. Oh, yes, that's where we're going to have to escape after we kill her, probably. That's how this game works. I hope she's not the final boss. I know we're very near the end. Yep, here we face the tentacle monster. That's all we do in this game is face tentacle monsters. Remember when there were zombies? I'm sure those weak spots will actually get registered. It's like that other boss. That thing is huge. Do you really think we can kill it? It's huge, you say? I'm gonna climb up here. Might be a good plan. Come on, Roger. Get your dumb ass up here, Shava. Oh god damn it. Thing is huge. Ooh woo. There we go, I ducked in time, thank goodness. Watch out! It's firing off some sort of projectile! Well, I imagine it's like that thing, or she's like the thing popping. Get necrosis, you little fucking weird ball. Reload. Jesus, heal me, heal me, heal me, heal me. Please heal me. You have healing shit. Heal me, you bitch. God damn it. Oh, 
Oh, great. Bad time to reload, Chris. Bad time to reload. Thank you for not letting me die there, Shayla. It took you long enough. She did have healing shit. Or she only have red herbs. Maybe. I swore she had uh, green herbs with the red herbs. Maybe just one. Oh, okay. That is a... Uh... Why are they glowing? I don't like that. What the fuck is this shit? What? You better start me off at the next phase of that fight. Jesus Christ, that was stupid. Oh. We're... We're gonna glow now. Oh, you're dead. Like, that's a bunch of bullshit. all the treasures. Ooh, upgrade. Tent. Okay, my color blindness is um apparently affecting me a bit. So. I can use an incendiary, incendiary grenade very well right now anyways, but um I guess I'll pick it up. Oh, thank you Shiva for just starting the boss fight. Yeah, we can kill this shit, it's easy. Okay, fine. Where is this target device? Oh. Oh, hello. It's all on you, Chris. I got your back. Oh, there we go. That's what it does. That reference to what I do, or are you just actually doing it as well? Oh, get the fuck away from me. Well, this is different than what happened before.
This is kind of the worst luck boss in some ways, like for the boss itself. Oh, God damn it. Is that actually all I had to do? Okay, nope, nope, nope. Chris, above you. Yes, I see it. How am I supposed to deal with that? So I guess I apparently have to keep dodging. Like, and I didn't even see any dodge prompt because this game again is a shell of the of its predecessor. Just fuck actually having quality control because that's I don't know bad or something. Yes, yes, I get it. It's a pretty God, boss fight. Do you really think we can kill it? Well, yeah, if the game lets me take the damn weapon out of there. Yes, don't let me... Uh... I'm not turning it off, no. It's all on you, Chris. I've got your back. Great. Can you heal me up, maybe? Yeah, Shayla, it's doing that. Oh, Tangia, yes, I turned off Tangia for uh, this. Yes, they're above me now. Chris, above you. The basic way I have right now is apparently I need to be able to dodge. Uh, very succinctly or some shit. No, I can't! Like... They did not give me a chance to dodge! Like... Exist and you die is what this fucking boss is. Jesus fucking Christ. Also, not like every other boss is a fucking gimmick. We had- you got laid on fire six ways till Sunday, you have this fucker. It's like... Could you maybe... have bosses that aren't... Complete gimmicks as a principle, maybe. Do you really think we can kill it? Yes, just. I'll never mind that the first part of this boss fight, if you're just gonna do what the. I hit the fucking shit game! I'm sorry you're too broken to see anything, but. Jesus it's Christ. All on you, Chris. I've got your back. 
Stop shooting at you, dum dum. I think it makes sense though, they don't want necessarily a bunch of, if I'm gonna put this on YouTube, I don't want a bunch of, uh, you know, random, Gordon Ramsay stuff. Okay, real question though. Have you seen anything where I'm supposed to actually be able to do any like Is that what I'm supposed to do? Just hope I can do it in time. Oh great. There we go. Great. So basically what I'm getting is, at the start, if you just happen to have a bit of bad timing, you're fucked. Ace Shava! Be less than useless! Jesus Christ. doesn't know what uh, boss fights are supposed to be like. Jamie, you are so useless. It's unbelievable how useless you are. Thanks for the help. Come on, Roger. 
Get up, you dumb, dumb. There he goes. It's finally over now. The shitty boss fight. Don't tell me he does it again. Just do not. Oh my god. Change controls on me, thank you, game. Do that. It's very fair. Just one spot in particular where the boss can just insta kill you for like no discernible reason. If that was the end in era, like it was like a key moment, it might make sense, but literally if it's just no discernible reason, that's just garbage design. Not that it should be a uh, surprise that this game has that at this point, but still. Still a bunch of ammo after this, presumably. Like I was fucking even shape like basically got it there. Oh, never mind. Oh great. I tried going for the change controls, because again the game changes controls on me. Can you not change what does duck? Of all things, just don't change what does duck. Just keep it one simple fucking thing. It's not DDR. Jesus Christ. I'm no great. It's just swinging back and forth so I can't get any hit on it. Like, fuck this game's idea of what a boss fight's meant to be. Constantly just be on guard for an attack that never stops. And be points that just don't actually appear or work half the goddamn time. God awful. It's one of the worst boss fights of this franchise. It makes the first game look like a fucking masterpiece. I'll tell you that. Chibi, you know you can shoot the fucking thing right there. Thank God! Not as bad as the uh, last chapter boss fight, that stupid tentacle monster that basically had weak points that pseudo existed, but still pretty bad. Jeez. He just has the worst boss fights. I can't. I do not understand why they did that uh, to their own game. Yeah, Excel Geo and she did. Yeah, I want to. Why do I want to keep playing after that boss? It was like none of the. Bosses in this game have been good. Actually, I can't think of a single good boss in this game. Holy shit. Ouch. I wasn't even trying to be that mean to the uh, devs, but holy shit. None of them are good. Alright, uh, we'll see what I play next. What time is it? Ah, 11. We'll see what I want to play. Uh, for now. Bye-bye.